Washington State 34, Arizona State 21. And I, well, let me just give you the numbers here. They they shocked them as a 16 and a half point underdog. Dude, yep. smart money, all the money started coming in on Arizona State late here. Yeah. It, they, it, Washington State won yards per play, 5.8 to 5.7. They won third downs, 40 to 38. They won rushing yards, 166 to 131. And they won turnovers, 5 to 1. Arizona State's you touchdowns came. They, they did not score until they were already down 28 to nothing. Then well, they yeah, scored I was again. Say, it was all, it was, I mean, I, I would yeah. say garbage time because they got down 28 nothing fast. So it's not yeah. like the and, game was over. And but. then they were down 34 to 7, and, and they scored was, two garbage time touchdowns. This was. About as shocking as it gets. I, I couldn't have been more wrong the last two weeks in Washington State. This is a team with a lot of heart, man. They are. A lot of heart, and I don't understand it. They they keep pulling this kind of stuff, and Jake Dickert will get the job. Well, no, he he's, be, I think, I think I, is there a reason you wouldn't give him the job? Because you're not pulling, like, a better name, right? Unless, Nobody unless really you, wants a woman. Well, that's what I was – unless you feel like uh, you want it because he's defensive coordinator – uh, unless you feel like the offense will eventually take a hit without Rolovich there, and you want to go get an offensive guy, yeah, they've that's always the kind of been. They've gone. They, they've really liked that air raid, but I mean, surely he can make sure that as long as I'm bringing in OCs that run that, you're okay. It's, I think that's it's a hell of a job. It's a, yeah. what, what he's doing, hell of a job. Didn't see it coming. Couldn't been more wrong. It's it's strange. It is very, very strange. The Pac-12 uh, standings as it sits right now. Uh, Washington, Weird as hell. Washington State is uh, a half game behind Oregon in the Pac-12 North. Uh, they're sitting at five and four as far as wins losses on the season, but they're four and two in conference. And their schedule remaining, they have got Oregon, Arizona, and at Washington. And I don't know of any of those that they couldn't win. The the game that messed me up in the Pac-12 yesterday was the Oregon State game. How in the hell does Cal almost score forty? I didn't have the, so I had that written down as like I know uh, I, know, I know we weren't going to talk about it, but like <laughs> in what how many teams I, in all of the hundred and thirty teams do you think Cal could play a normal football game and score forty on? There's there's not many, and I didn't expect it on Oregon State, who had been playing yeah, well as of late. Uh, Oregon State was one of my so I went five and two against the spread on on BetUS uh, last week, and that was one of my losses because I had Oregon yeah. State minus one and a half because my line on that was Oregon State minus six, yeah. and with the way that they were able to run the football on Utah, I did not expect them to uh, have many issues against Cal, uh, but they did, but they absolutely did. But they did. That's, uh, that's right Arizona they did. State's win percentage, uh, post game win expectancy in this game was actually seventy two percent. The five the five turnovers killed them, and it, obviously five turnovers will kill anybody. Kill anybody. But uh, <laughs> man, yeah, Arizona State. Like uh, <laughs> at this point, I don't know what to make of Arizona State going forward. Like Jaden Daniels was not like he wasn't he wasn't the worst. He was twenty three out of thirty five, two hundred twenty eight yards passing, one touchdown, two picks. I had 10 carries, 31 yards, actually went out for a little bit. Uh, Trenton Borget, I believe is the guy's name, came in three out of four passing, 47 yards, one touchdown. So, I, you know, this this was this was interesting. Arizona State is now sitting at 5-3. and three. They're 3-2 three and two in the Pac-12 South, and I thought they would show up here. They've got USC next. They got at Washington, at Oregon State, and they close with Arizona. So, it's not exactly a murderer's row, but they play like this. They could lose to any of them. So that's two straight losses for the Sun Devils. Thanks for listening to the Winning Cures Everything podcast. The website is winningcureseverything.com. And if you want to connect with us, we're on Twitter at GaryWCE, at Chris B. Giannini, at Winning Cures, or you can email us, Gary at winningcureseverything.com or Chris at winningcureseverything.com. Subscribe everywhere you need to subscribe, and we'll see you soon.